Nelson, Nevada is a great place to go exploring the desert as well as a bit of the history of the Wild West. It's a bit of a ghost town now with only about 20 people who live here. And as you pass through the main ghost town area, you'll feel like you've been transported back in time several decades. It was originally called El Dorado by the Spaniards. They didn't happen to notice the silver and gold hidden in these mountains. By the 1850s, the Tecate Cup mine opened. Prospectors were coming into the area hoping to stake their claim and it attracted a lot of violence. During the Civil War we had a lot of deserters who came here because they didn't think anybody would come look for them in this remote location. Between the miners staking their claims and the fugitives that just seemed to get drawn here anyway, it became such a dangerous place that even law enforcement was afraid to come in. Today it has a canoe rental, and if you stay on the road that goes by it, it takes you down to where the road ends at Lake Mojave. There used to be a little village here called Nelson's Landing. Unfortunately, 1974, it flooded and the village was covered with debris and water. And now it's just a place to go hiking, enjoy the um, skiing on the water like these folks are doing. We picked a bit of an overcast day to come out here. But it's a great place to go explore. Nelson, Nevada for a real slice of old Wild West history. This is Debbie at LVHomePro.com your guide to Las Vegas.